Okay, we're back with another video tutorial by iTheme TV, and today I'm going to show you how you can change the color of the text that's displayed under all your icons. So the first thing you're going to want to do is open up your theme folder, and in this folder we are going to create a new text document, and just open that up. And we're basically writing a little bit of XML markup, so we'll start with that. And just to speed this up, I'm just going to copy the rest of this in here. And there we go. So this is what you need to have just to start off. So next, first, now we're going to put in our first value. So we're going to put in a key tag. And between this tag, you're going to put capital D, doc, capital I, icon, capital L, label, and capital S style um, and then you're going to close that tag and then down here you're going to open up string and then type in color and here you're going to put a hexadecimal value and if you don't know what hexadecimal value is it's basically a six digit code that tells you what color um, it is. So I'm going to put in blue, and blue is 0000, zero, zero, zero um, FF. And you can find uh, the code, there are the hexadecimal values for colors just online. If you just type in hexadecimal and colors in Google, a uh, site should pop up and you can find them there. And you can also find them in programs like Photoshop, on the Color Blender, and also in Paint. I'm not sure about that, but possibly in paint. And now we're just going to close this. And I'm just going to, just to speed this up, I'm just going to copy this. And the next one is the same thing. All you want to do is type in undocked icons. And if you want to change the color, just change the hexadecimal value. So now we're going to close the dict tag. And we're also going to close um, the P list. And there, you're done. And I'm just going to make sure that this is all right, not messing up any of the syntax, because then it won't work, which is not a good thing. So, okay, so everything seems to be good. And you're going to want to go to Save As. And we are going to save this as info dot plist. And it has to be saved under that file name uh, for this to work. So just click Save. And there it is. And you should get the little quick time symbol with pref under there. And you can just delete this one. So now that we have that, you're just going to want to... Uh, we'll close this for now. And we'll open up WinSCP. And we'll go to stash themes, and we will delete your old theme folder, and we will put in the new one with the new XML or the info.plist file. And once that's done, um, you can just respring your device, and your text should appear blue or whatever color you specified and I'll just post a video showing what that looks like after I'm finished with this one okay